Oh. Gotcha. What's up guys, my name is Kelvin Wiley and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are new, if you could please hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon and turn on post notifications. That way you're alerted every time that I post a new video. So as you saw from just simply reading the title of the video, but also viewing the thumbnail and watching the intro, I am going to be stinging myself with a female Eastern Cicada Killer, Specia Speciosus. Now, before I get into actually stinging myself, I just want to let you all know that I have been stung by this species three times already on three separate occasions. I have the videos posted on Instagram and on TikTok of me stinging myself from this wasp, but I never got a video of it to post on YouTube. So I figured why not make a YouTube video of me stinging myself with an Eastern Cicada Killer. If you haven't seen my last video, I posted a video of me catching a male Eastern Cicada Killer. Now, if you watch that video, you will know that male Eastern Cicada Killers, well, just male wasps in general, cannot sting. So, you know, I was not able to physically sting myself with that because they can't sting. So today I caught a female, so I will be stinging myself with her. And uh, right now I am sitting under a tree uh, taking in some shade because it is super hot out here. It's like 90 something right now. I don't know if you could see the uh, sweat on my face, but uh, I'm just trying to cool down. Uh, but yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the video. So really quickly, I just wanted to share with you guys some stickers that I have for sale on my website. All of these are of various animals that I drew on paper, and then I converted those drawings into stickers. Just to give you an idea of what they look like up close, all of these stickers are extremely durable, they're long lasting, and they are also waterproof as well. This is of a Southern Black Widow that I drew. And as you can see, these are all legit hand drawings that I've made using those markers right there. So if any of you would like to support my small business, you can head on over to kelvinwiley.net. Again, that is kelvinwiley.net. I appreciate every single one of you. Thank you for supporting my website, but also supporting this channel as well. And now, back to the video. All right, so probably as I'm stinging myself uh, with this female Eastern Cicada Killer, I might actually ditch the tongs because this wasp is super big and these tongs are not really, or I should say tweezers. <laughs> these tweezers are not um, very good in supporting this wasp because of its large size. So I might like midway through sting myself, I might actually just use my fingers just, just to hold it down, use my, use my hand. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let me sting myself. And there we go. All right, so stinger is going through. Try to get some other angles on my arm. There we go. And as you can see, this wasp, I mean, judging by the size, and if you don't know much about this wasp species, it may look intimidating and may look, you know, scary that it might have really powerful, potent venom. But the venom of this wasp is not, oh, actually, yeah, see, this is what I mean. I almost lost it because I didn't have a good grip on the, uh, on the tweezer. So let me switch to my hand. Try to maneuver this. Uh, there we go. All right, cool. All right, let me uh, continue. So, yeah, this wasp, its venom is fairly mild, and that is, that is because this is a species of solitary wasp. They are not, um, they don't belong to a colony or anything. They're not eusocial, so they don't have much to defend for. That's why they don't go after humans and try to sting them. If you come in contact with them, they are a uh, fairly non-aggressive wasp. So that is something to not be fearful of. Next time you see one, yeah, it's going in pretty deep in my skin. Let me see if I can get some close-up shots. And it just keeps going. Uh, what was I saying? 
lost my train of thought. Oh yeah, so this wasp, its venom is strictly geared towards paralyzing cicadas. So that's its main purpose. And so knowing that this wasp, its venom really is not for defense. It's for paralyzing cicadas to feed its young, its larvae to consume on. And as you can see, it has mandibles, pretty sharp mandibles, but not sharp enough to penetrate or rip up human skin. And it just keeps going. As you can see, my arm is starting to swell up with hives. And yeah, I mean, I, I don't know how many songs I just, <laughs> how many things I just took, but, uh, it was quite a few, to say the least, as you can see, by the hive swelling up. But yeah, I mean, that is pretty much it. So I'm going to release this wasp right now. Actually, let me do my outro as it's continuing to sting me. <laughs> so if you guys don't already follow me on Instagram at Kelvin Wiley and on TikTok at Kelvin underscore Wiley, check out my website, kelvinwiley.net. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that bell icon if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next video.